What I do next, and I'll, I, I haven't finished yet using the Restorer finish, I'm going to show you a couple of other examples, but I must move to this, to the feed and wax. This is an absolute must when you're using Restorer finish. To finish this job off and to make it look really good, I need to nourish it and add a coating to it. This is going to put a coating over the Restorer finished finish to protect it so that finger marks and scratches and things like that just simply won't occur again. At least they won't occur very easily. Here's what I do. I simply wipe it on. See what I'm doing there? I'm just simply wiping it on. I'm using way too much, but I'm only doing that because you need to see how it works. But there's a little bit, and even that will just spread and spread and spread. As you can see, the grain really comes to life. Go up here, for instance, if the camera can go up there, look carefully at the grain, and now watch what happens when I apply the feed and wax to it. The grain just simply leaps out at you. And all you do is let it dry for 20 minutes. Just let the wax dry for 20 minutes, and when you come back to it after 20 minutes, you simply wipe it out, and it will be absolutely completely dry, and it will look like a new finish. Absolutely brilliant way to restore furniture. Restore